Do you like lo-fi beats? I want to earn money while posting lo-fi beats on your own channel. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can do just that while earning the sweet ad revenue from YouTube. You, you don't need to pay anything. You don't need to purchase any expensive tools. The only thing you're going to be needing is your own laptop and a pair of headphones. And I'm going to show you exactly how to get your channel up and running while also putting zero investment on to you on your side and while also making more than $3,500 every single month. And I'm going to show you exactly how these small channels are also doing the same thing. So if we're all set for this, let's get into the video. What is up guys in this video, I'm going to show you how are you going to be able to make more than $3,500 every single month just by posting simple lo-fi beats? And for this example, I'm going to be showing you a channel named Lo-Fi Ghosty. And Lo-Fi Ghosty is a channel that has significant amount of subscribers. As you can see here, it has 46,000.9 subscribers. That is about uh, 47,000. And the stats, if we go, go here and look, uh, this channel has earned more than 5 million views and the funny part here is that this channel has only posted just two videos over the course of one year so as you can see here they're they're getting a ton of views one of their videos got 3.2 million and other video got 1.9 million which is a, a really really good thing and i think a lot of the channels are not getting that many views uh by simply posting a, a, a playlist right here and the the cool part here is that they're only posting they, they have only posted two videos and the 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 really good keyword that they've used is called coding uh sessions so now if you guys as you can see here they have used this uh 3 30 a.m coding session now coding lo-fi beats are actually a thing and i'm not sure if you know about this or uh or if you know about this the coding sessions uh, what people do is they they post this these lo-fi beats and they apply some coding you know music background to it they add some keyboard i'm um, sorry keyboard uh, effects to it and they add some rainy effects and then they call it a day just make simple lo-fi videos and just name them as coding sessions so you know the people who actually want to code you know who code in like java or something in javascript C sharp, whatever they're coding, whatever they're making apps or whatever, and they want to put music uh, on background, they can actually go ahead and do that. They, they just go ahead and and, and uh, just load your your video and maybe just search uh, music for coding, you know. So that's in which you can actually go ahead and get a lot of views. Now this channel right here, as you can see, uh, has only posted two videos, and they're only posting coding videos, which is called code fi i don't know i'm not sure if you know about this it's called code fi and if i can if i can just search here code fi all right so code fi is also kind of like a niche in lo-fi beats and it has coding session music uh, coding music all that you can just go ahead and post some simple uh you know simple animation here and just uh show people that you're just coding and they're going to be able to, you know, learn from that uh, experience and they're going to be able to actually benefit from that ex experience by you simply posting coding music here. So coding music is nothing but lo-fi beats. So uh, if I can go ahead and go to one of these uh, other channels, this one is called Code and Chill. And this is pretty amazing because as you can see here, they're not really posting that much. But what they're doing is they're simply just posting a simple uh, computer screen and they're actually just adding uh, some music to it you can just go ahead and look at this up yourself i'm not going to play the music because they will it will get copyrighted so they're actually just going uh, going ahead and using other people's music here and just posting now this is all copyright music so i don't I'm, i don't think that they're actually monetized but they can actually go ahead and license the music and they can actually go ahead and make it by yourself in this video i'm going to actually show you that you can how you can actually be able to make the video make the the music by yourself by just you know taking 10 minutes of your time Th these videos don't take that much uh, long to, to produce i'm going to actually go ahead and show you exactly how you're going to be able to do that in this video in this video 
and you're going to be able to make uh, learn how to make them pretty easily so so that's the the audio part here uh the m main part here is that visuals because the beats are not that they're hard to make they're you know you can just make them in 10 minutes that are not really that hard to make and the visual part here is that is that going to be the, the key here so you want to make sure you you're using the right keyword which is coding lo-fi coding music and you're using a simple uh you know illustration of a computer or you're using some kind of a, a you know video that shows a person coding you can actually go ahead and do that that's also pretty much uh the you know fit into to that niche code code fire niche all right so now i'm going to go ahead and show you uh how you can actually go ahead and make a video or something like this once you have that you can go ahead and go to a website known as looperman now want to go go to looperman and you want to search for something that's called lo-fi so you want to go to the keyword and search for lo-fi so once you're in here and you can go ahead and you know listen to all these uh these loops right here all right so you can go ahead and use this and you can go ahead and download this and once you're downloaded you you, you can go ahead and just get started now the other thing you need is lo-fi drums so i, I want to go ahead and search for that as well so just download lo-fi a melody and and one drum that's going to be it for that this one so you can go ahead and click on any of them all right so you can go ahead and download these two and get started so i'm going to show you just in a moment all right guys so now you want to do is uh you want to go ahead and just uh use the the audio that you just downloaded and now you just want to go ahead and open up your daw so now here i'm using fl studio i'm using the fl studio um i have a trial version but it does let me uh, export the audio somehow i don't know why but you guys can if you don't have fl studio if you don't have any other program uh you guys can go ahead and use some other program like uh you know uh, you can use a free DAW or you can use, uh, if you're using Mac, you can go ahead and use uh, the you know, GarageBand, which is free, which comes free on the uh, MacBook. Now, if you're not using MacBook, you can go ahead and search for free DAW and you can find a bunch of these uh, free DAWs that are available and you can go ahead and download them and use them. However, for this instance, I'm using FL Studio and I'm I have just uh, basically used uh, the loop here. I have actually got the loop uh, going on here and I have two loops. One is this guitar loop. All right. The other one is this uh, drum loop. Now together it sounds something like this. Now, obviously, I can go ahead and, and, and change the uh, the BPM rate to make the sound a little bit uh, slower. Just to make it more, uh, you know, just a bit more sad or, you know, less uh, in your face kind of thing. So definitely you can go ahead and play around and play around with the sounds, play around with the, uh, the samples. And these samples are free to use, so you can go ahead and... Uh, just just use them and then just go ahead and make a full song out of it and upload that uh, song the, you know just download the song and I'm sorry the export the song and just upload the song make a whole playlist uh, out of this and you can go ahead and get something going on like the code five guys are doing all right guys so now I'm gonna go ahead and look for the animated side of the video so I just go ahead, I just went ahead and I found out this uh, little coding GIF and th this looks pretty good. This looks like something that I can use in one of my videos. So I can go ahead and just, uh, just download this one. I found it on Pinterest.com. So you can go ahead and look it up on Pinterest and you can, and then the, the keyword that I searched for was animated coding GIF. And once I did that, I found this, this GIF right here and I downloaded that GIF and I uh, uploaded it to Canva here. So now in Canva, we're going to go ahead and make the, the full final video. So now let me just go ahead and uh, make the video right now. So now I've done that and I want to make sure that the video looks uh, nice and perfect. I use the 1920 by 1080 so full HD video. 
uh, preference here. And now I'm going to go ahead and uh, just make this video look more cohesive. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, color this. So let's see if we can find that. All right, so I just want to go ahead and use the same color as the background. And once that's done, you're going to be having something like this. So this looks pretty, pretty good, pretty neat. The only thing left is going to be the audio. So I'm going to go ahead and add the audio and finish the whole project. All right, so I just uploaded the uh, the audio here. Now the audio is only 36 uh, seconds long because just for tutorial's sake, I don't I don't want to make the whole full one hour long mix here. So I just uh, I just uploaded the one uh, you know 36 second long uh, clip here. Now you now for your instance, you, you definitely want to go ahead and make multiple music, make multiple songs, and then just go ahead and upload all of them at the same time and just make a, a, an hour long playlist. And you want to make your own music just because if you make your own music, just like I did here, I showed you how I made the whole music, the whole track. Uh, you're going to be able to monetize this. You're going to be able to have, you know, earn money from this and, you know, not get copyrighted. So it's super important here. Now I'm just going to go ahead and drag and drop the audio. And I'm going to align the audio here. So it just uh, aligns perfectly. And I just want to stretch this thing. All right. So this is going to be just 36 second long, but um, it's just for instance uh, here. And I just made it for this tutorial's sake. So now I'm just going to go ahead and play this thing. Let's see how it sounds. It sounds really good and it also feels pretty good and it has the kind of vibe to it that I think I can actually go ahead and upload and you know just a lot of people are going to be you know liking this things like this you can just make this video a lot longer uh just the way I showed it it's just 36 uh, 36 second long you definitely definitely want to go ahead and make this longer so now that's done the only thing left is just uploading and make sure when you upload the you know these uh beats guys make sure you actually just go ahead and uh turn these into creative comments so you don't get copyright claims okay all right so that way you're gonna also monetize your video you're gonna be able to monetize the video you're gonna be able to uh, earn money from the video and you also are less much less likely to have your video get taken down by copyright claims all right so with that being said guys this is it for this video if you enjoyed please hit the thumbs up and please please subscribe this video if you want to see more videos like these i do uh, think I'm gonna be uploading uh, much more many more videos after this one and I'm I can't wait to make sure that you guys uh, you know be, be the first one to see the video so you want to go ahead and uh, subscribe and hit the bell icon and once that's done I'm gonna see you guys in the next one